nice and frothy. Howdy, and welcome to the Texas Bucket List, where summer is always on our minds, especially when it comes to quenching our thirst in the Texas heat. Luckily, we found a tropical oasis, a destination right in the middle of the Lone Star State, known as Toucan Gyms. Center Point, Texas isn't exactly the center point of the state, but its location on the banks of the Guadalupe River make it a clandestine destination between Comfort and Kerrville. But the truly hidden gem in this tiny town sits behind this tired looking shack that happens to have a tropical oasis behind it. Now this isn't St. Martin, St. John, or St. Kitts. It's not even Tulum or Trinidad, despite what the tables say. It's simply a huge backyard that underwent an extensive decade-long transition by these guys, Jim Lackey and Mike Blackledge. Together you guys are... Toucan Jims. These beach bum buddies had a big idea back in the day. Instead of packing your bags, getting on a plane, flying to a faraway destination, and finally making it to a resort in order to enjoy a Havana-like haven, why not bring that feeling just a few feet from home? We can always tell a first-timer because their expression is just, their eyes light up. And you can see them yeah. mouthing the word, wow. You don't realize you're in the middle of town. Well, no. and the longer you're out here, the more that sets in. We all love the Caribbean, we love Belize, Mexico, but for the people that can't live there, we said, well, maybe you can come here and, and maybe for just a few minutes of your day, make you think you're someplace else. After a while, you forget you're even in Texas. Now this is Jim's old house. He grew up here, and when he inherited it, he had this bright idea to bring the tropics to Texas. There's not a day goes by that we don't have someone tell us Man, this reminds me of Cancun. This reminds me of Jamaica. This reminds me of Hawaii. And we really take that as a compliment. This place is so Caribbean feeling. When you hear the planes go by, you feel like somebody's leaving paradise. Yeah. It's like when you're in Mexico, <laughs> yeah. you're like, bye, bye. Well, this yeah. is, I, I, we promise you, it's a lot cheaper than going to the Caribbean. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, and yeah. you can drive home in the evening. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Spend the night in your own bed. Yeah. The transition from Central Texas backyard to resort-like relaxation took years to finish. Jim is the gardener of the group. You guys built, planted, and did this whole place. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Right. That's a lot of work. Yeah. Yep. You know, normally when people tell you your backyard's a jungle, that's not a compliment, but. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. well, that's true. Yeah. And you noticed, you probably noticed our signs that, hey, it's a jungle out here. Make sure your server knows we're here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. This is an amazing garden, Jim. Well, thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> this, uh, this is a southern magnolia here that my mom actually planted 45 to 50 years ago. Wow. And I can remember when it was a stick. So uh, So this uh, started the garden then? This is what started everything and, and everything else was really built around it. I see magnolia trees like this in Houston, but this is amazing. Mike, in the meantime, makes all the tables, chairs, and palapas. So one thing that gives it away that you're in the middle of Central Texas, the cedar barstools. <laughs> yeah. I don't think well, I've seen a cedar bar you know, in the Caribbean. Uh, yeah. Price was a factor there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jim and I put in a pretty good day. Yeah. Not not uncommon for us to put in a 16 hour day, seven days a week. Not a whole lot of time sitting around sipping margaritas. But that's what they want you to do. We yeah. have some excellent drinks. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, uh, we've sampled all of them. <laughs> <laughs> We're known for our margaritas, uh, pina coladas, the Barbados Surprise, and the rum punch is a big seller. Tanya, the bartender, was ready to take us on a tropical tour. Do we start with strong and go to weak, or do we start weak and go strong? I think we should go with strong. Let's do strong. All right, let's do a margarita. All right. House made mix? Yes. Oh, yeah. That puts you on the island. I'm in Mexico right now. Oh, yeah. Ay, yeah, yeah. Now I need some chips and salsa. Absolutely. <laughs> Next up? We'll do a pina colada. You know, when it comes to pina coladas, you gotta have one for each hand. It's like traveling with drinks. Yes. Are you on your way to Aruba right now? It's so delicious and frothy. Well, how about I make you a rum punch? That's yeah. our number one seller here. Number one seller to the punch. We spent almost a year working on the rum punch recipe. Ooh, it's a pretty drink. Adding hey. to the collection of straws. You get a pretty little straw. Man, I feel like this is definitely one of those uh, pinky drinks. 
Okay, that tastes like Kool-Aid. Yeah. The key to these tasty drinks, fresh juices. We had tasted it down in Belize and we knew what we wanted and uh, trying to find the, the proper fruits for it up here was real difficult. We experimented and experimented and experimented until we finally came up with the mix that works for us. And I'll be the first to say that the experimental part of the rum punch was fun. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Always rough trying new I drinks. We, yeah, I yeah, think we yeah. stretched that out a little bit longer than we should have stretched <laughs> it out. Finally, we finished things off with a Barbados surprise. So what's the big surprise, how it tastes? You have to, you have to stir it. Stir it. So stir, stir first. It's like a witch's brew. Oh my gosh. What does red, blue, and white make? Purple. It's a purple drink. Does it taste like purple drink? It tastes like purple drink. There's alcohol in this. There is alcohol in there. You gotta be careful how many of those you drink. Yeah. Rock on. Mm -hmm. Well, cheers. Cheers. Now I need to go find four friends. Thank you, Tanya. You're very welcome. Come on, let's go quick. So if you're looking for a taste of the tropics right here in the Lone Star State, Toucan Gyms is a terrific spot to relax and enjoy that fun in the sun feeling on the Texas bucket list. We're not just saying this, we promise that they're really good drinks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> a rough gig, somebody's gotta do it. Yeah. yeah.